So now we're on, this is the mudstone bedding around us. This flat, nearly horizontal plane is the bedding. And if we look on the bedding right here, we'll see this thing that looks a little bit like a starfish. But it's not a starfish. It's what we call a glendonite. And notice how it's a glendonite, and it has these little pointy ends. One, two, three, four. It can have numerous pointy bits. Each one of these is a crystal. So it's a crystal that in three dimensions would be having would be sending up here, but it's been weathered off the top. Now this crystal was originally not glendonite. Glendonite is a name for these things. It comes from the Sydney Basin, a locality north of here. And what these things were originally is called IKI, which is a calcium carbonate water crystal. So these things only exist in fairly deep, very cold water. So these things established without any doubt that this water was very cold seawater. And what's interesting is these things get trapped in the mud and then they get replaced by minerals that are stable, like magnesium and calcium carbonate, without water. So that these things are pseudomorphs. It's a pseudomorphic replacement of the crystals that were there.